have our root vegetables. So Mikey told me we have some really cool purple potatoes. Mikey, where are purple potatoes come from? Seven has been working with Sal Valenza and Kim Gray of New Way Concessionaires at West New York Public Schools for over five years now. They made the conscious decision to feature local products and the bounty of the Garden State. We've been excited to work with them on that so we can help them tell the story of all these great farmers and also how the food is grown. Their enthusiasm and passion that they bring to their program is what sets it apart. Over the past seven years, the growth of this program has been incredible, exponential, and very, very organic. Um, at this point, we're working with Zone 7. We're getting deliveries once or twice a week from probably 30 or 40 different farms throughout the year. And it's wonderful because we've been able to take a program that started as just bits and pieces, and we are now serving Jersey Fresh Produce in our schools throughout the entire year. We make it through the winter. So it's, it's one of those things that you, you didn't think would happen, but did. What I really think sets West New York and New Way Food Service apart in their ability to pull this off is simply the adventurous spirit that they have to expose the students to all the different varieties, funky, interesting flavors, textures, colors that are out there and that are available locally. The second thing is their ability and willingness to cook. And they're so lucky to have Chef Kim Gray on their staff and she and her cooking ability enables them to really work with a lot of different ingredients throughout the entire year. I think it's very important to teach the kids what the Garden State is. All our kids know that our license plates say the Garden State, but they don't know why. So we incorporate a lot of learning from where our fields come from, all our farms in New Jersey, and we learn about the agricultural departments. And what it does for us is bring it from the ground to our tables. And we learn every step in between to how it got to there, and a lot of why it's good for us. One of the funny things that the kids do is Chef Kim brings, a, brings me soup every now and then and the kids love it so they try to bribe me with different things that they'll give me so that I can give them my soup. So it's really cute and um, they actually, we did a lesson on how to follow steps, one to what goes first, next, third and last and they learned how to make soup that way. So it's a lot of fun. There was a day that I served peas on my serving line and had a child come up to me and say, I want that. And I said, well, what is that? And he said, well, I don't know. I said, well, you, you don't know what it is? He said, it's green corn. So they had no idea what peas were. They now know what pawpaws are. They now know what beets are. They know what asparagus is. They eat things that people said to me they will never eat that. And they ask for it. And that's incredible to me, that we have little kids that are loading up on beets, they're loading up on broccoli, they're loading up on cauliflower. And that's because it's become part of the culture in this school. Never would have happened without the partnership between Zone 7, New Way, and the West New York schools.